Colonial Trot. Field of nine is in motion. And they're off and trotting. Annie's SJ had a good start along the inside. Moving out with them fast. Partnership problem is looking for the front. Keystone Holiday drives on. And emerging on the far outside is Banker Hall. Banker Hall moving up but wide out of that uh, first eighth of the mile. Moving through his final bowl along the inside. Fourth from last but parked, CR Pants on fire ahead of Titanic Tag. Second to last but parked out is CR Bellman and Tiff Tough Tag is trailing ninth at the inside. Banker Hall sweeps over to take the front and open two off a quarter of 28 and one fifth. Banker Hall trotting strong around the first turn and partnership problem is tagging along in second, endeavoring to close the gap with Keystone Holiday third at the inside and Annie's SJ has already moved to the outside first up, but he went off stride for Campbell on the way to the half. Sitting five trotters back, now inheriting fourth, his final bowl, CR Pants on fire, is on the outside from fifth. Titanic tag, sixth at the inside. CR Bellman, seventh and wide all the way. Tiff Tough tag, and then Annie's SJ is still off stride. They made the half in 57 and four. Banker Hall and Trevor Ritchie coddling his speed well onto the final turn. Partnership problem tags along in second. Keystone Holiday, two more lengths to the inside third. Final bowl is trotted an inside trip from fourth. CR Bellman, wide all the way, is now fifth. CR Pants on fire. Sixth on the inside. Tiff Tough Tag is up to seventh. No move yet for Titanic Tag from eighth. And Annie's SJ is out of it from ninth. And Banker Hall, it's his to win or lose. He's on top by five. And Richie's looking to cut him loose down the lane. He wheels off the turn to a lead of five. One, 27 and one. 29 and two. Third quarter. And Banker Hall causing Richie to look over his left shoulder, look over his right shoulder, and he's seeing a five-length advantage in deep stretch to win impressively in the second division, 2001 Colonial Trot. Banker Hall is home in an under wraps, 56-2 and two, uh, over partnership problem and final bowl. Seven, Banker Hall was back as Woodbine's eighth race winner in the second division of the 2001 Colonial Trot. The balanced image three-year-old bay colt from Bicor Jazette, owned by Tommy Anderson of Gotain, Sweden, trained by Harold Lunday and driven to victory by Trevor Ritchie. First and two this year, 156 and two for Banker Hall in the eighth. Thanks again to Tom Charters, executive director of the Breeders' Crown Series. For the presentation to the Colonial Trot second division winner, Banker Hall and Connections. She, uh, pretty impressive. How did you think he was tonight compared to uh, how have you seen him coming into this point? Well, he was very strong tonight. He, uh, he, he's been good. Uh, when, he, uh, when he made the break, he was just too aggressive. He was actually even too aggressive in the qualifier, but uh, tonight he seemed a little more relaxed, and uh, hopefully as we go along, he'll get even more relaxed. Uh, but he was uh, good and strong. Uh, let's talk about the win time, 56-2, and two, but it looked like he had something left at the end. Yeah, he felt real strong. Halfway through the lane, uh, he just started to relax a little bit on me, and I didn't know if he was tired or just relaxing. And I looked back, and uh, I thought I seen one maybe closing in on him a little bit, and I just turned the whip and laid it on his tail, and I could just feel him surge forward. Coming into the Trotting Classic eliminations, uh, could you be any happier with the way he goes in? No, I mean, he finished strong tonight. That's the way you want him to go into a, a race, finishing strong the race before, and uh, he was trotting sound, so uh, no, he, he looks uh, pretty good. All right, congratulations. We look forward to seeing him next week. Thanks, Greg. Trevor Ritchie and Banker Hall, they come through tonight, 156-2, and two, identical win times tonight in the Colonial. No changes in race number 